नमस्कार माई सेल्फ लव ओझा फ्रॉम डेमोस्ट्रेशन मल्टीपर्पज स्कूल भुवनेश्वर स्टूडेंट्स देर इज ए पिक्चर हेयर सी द पिक्चर इन वन केस चिल्ड्रेन आर ईटिंग फूड सडनली ए काइट फ्लाइज डाउन एंड टेक अवे फूड क्विकली इन सेकेंड केस ए डॉग इज मूविंग अराउंड ए स्लीपिंग डॉग एंड सडनली द ईयर्स ऑफ डॉग शूट्स अप इन थर्ड केस वेन सम स्वीट्स आर ड्रॉप ऑन ग्राउंड विद इन फ्यू मिनट्स many ants collected around it how they do that well they do that with the help of their powerful senses and this is called super senses and today we have to go through this interesting topic super senses as you know we have different senses they are they include senses of smelling sight hearing tasting and touching with the help of these senses we will interact with the our surroundings animals do have amazing senses with the help of these senses they see their prey from far away hear even the faintest sound find their friends by their smell now we take some examples suppose there is a ant hole some guard ants are guarding that hole some ants are in search of food suddenly this ant see that many ants of another group coming towards it it quickly goes back into the hole the guard ants let this ant to go inside the hole but when these ants come near they attack on them now question is how these ants identify its group member well they do so with the help of smell actually ants have antenna antenna and they sense the smell take another example you must have seen ants move in line suppose one ant left behind but the ants the ants never forget their path they follow the path as usual how they do so will again they do so with the help of a smell actually when ants move they leave a smell on the ground and the ants behind that follow that smell and they move in line some male insects recognize their females by the smells male silkworm can find their female silkworms from far far kilometers away that is many kilometers away as you are imagining it is very amazing now dogs also mark out their own area we learn about that later on police also use powerful sense of smell of dogs to catch criminals and even to find out 
the explosives and also find out the terrorists. Now, there is picture here. A dog is sniffing here and there. What could be the reason behind that? Well, actually dogs mark out their area with their urine. They mark out their area with their urine. In the outer boundary, inside also, they do potty and urinate and mark out their area. When some another dog comes in that area, the dogs of that area at once know that an intruder dog is coming inside. How? Well, with the smell of that dog. And all the dogs attack on the intruder to drive them away. And in this way, sense of smell helps animal in many ways. We have also sense of smell and it is also helpful for us. Many times you recognize what type of food is preparing in kitchen. How it is possible? With the help of our sense of smell. When something is burning, we become alert. How we know that something is burning? Again, with the help, help of our smell. If cooking gas, if there is leakage, is leakage in cooking gas, we know it and take action. Food has got a spoilt or not, we know it again with the help of our sense of smell. That means our sense of smell also help us in many ways. Now look at this picture. This is Susila. She covered her nose with dupatta. Actually, her sister has gone outside for some important work and left her baby with her sister Susila. Susila has also her own baby and interestingly, both the babies did the potty at the same time. While clearing the potty of her own baby, Susila comfortably did that, but while she was clearing the potty of her sister's baby, she felt very bad smell. Why? Actually, she was used to with the smell of the potty of her own baby, but not with the smell of the potty of her sister's baby. Therefore, she had to cover the nose with the putta. Now, see there are two pictures. Now, look only the position of eyes a bird and position of eyes of human being. In the case of bird, it is on the either side of the head. But in case of girl or human being, it is in front of head. Is there any use in case of bird? The position of eyes? Yes. Actually, Birds have many natural enemies and the position of the eyes, that means on the other side of the head, gives it 
wider range of view so that if a predator come from behind it can see that and can fly away now in our case our eyes are in front of us is there any benefit yes with the help of that we can correctly estimate the distance of any object that means the position of our eyes are also helpful for us why not on either side of the head because human being have very few or no natural enemies therefore that is not required now see the picture of birds many times you have seen that birds are moving their neck to see around why not they move their eyes because they cannot move their eyes they have fixed eyes therefore to see around they have to move their neck now in class 4 you have read that elephants have very big ears and they use that to cool their body and they act as fan is there any benefit now let us do an activity at your home ask your brother or sister to stand at some distance and say something softly now try to hear that sound next time again ask her brother and sister and say something softly and at that time keep your ears behind like this and now try to listen that sound you will see that when you keep your hands behind your ears it is very sharp you get sharper sound and in this way big ears help us to clear sound in fact men those animals have big ears they are benefited having big ears and they can hear sharper sounds now how do snakes hear let's an again do an activity you sit on a table and tap tap on desk and hear that sound next time you put your ear on the desk and tap again and find the difference between two sounds in second time you see that the sound was clear and sharper and this is the way the snakes hear since snakes do not have external ears they feel the vibration in the ground animals also use their sound for alarming other members of the group langur make alarm calls like hu hu to make alert other members of the group from the enemies like panther tiger snakes birds also make alarm calls in fact they make different alarm calls when the enemy is from the sky they make different sounds when the enemy is from the ground they make different alarm calls fish also make alarm calls by electric signals now there is picture here circles are also here and animals are there first is cow 
वन सर्किल मीन्स ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स वन सर्किल इज डिवाइड इन टू ट्वेल्व पार्ट वन पार्ट इज इक्वल टू टू आवर्स नाउ इन केस ऑफ काउ सी हाउ मेनी पार्ट्स आर डार्क देयर आर टू पार्ट्स आर डार्क दैट मीन्स काउ स्लीप फॉर ओनली टू इंटू टू फोर आवर्स पाइथन पाइथन स्लीप मोस्ट ऑफ द टाइम्स इट रिमेन अवेक फॉर अगेन सी देयर आर थ्री वाइट बॉक्सेस दैट मीन्स थ्री थ्री जा थ्री टू जा सिक्स दैट मीन्स पाइथन स्लीप ओनली पाइथन अवेक ओनली फॉर सिक्स आवर्स रेस्ट ऑफ द टाइम इट स्लीप जिराफ इन द पिक्चर यू कैन सी ओनली वन पार्ट इज डार्क दैट मीन्स जिराफ स्लीप ओनली स्लीप ओनली फॉर टू आवर्स एंड कैट कैट स्लीप फॉर ट्वेल्व आवर्स एंड रिमेन अवेक फॉर ट्वेल्व आवर्स दैट मीन इट शो इज दैट डिफरेंट एनिमल्स रिमेन अवेक एंड स्लीप फॉर डिफरेंट टाइम्स दे आर स्लीपिंग एंड अवेकिंग टाइम वेरीज नॉक्टर्नल एनिमल्स रिमेन एक्टिव एट नाइट एंड रेस्ट ऑफ द एनिमल्स रिमेन एक्टिव एट डे टाइम नाउ टाइगर इट इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट अलर्ट एनिमल्स हाउ बिकॉज इट हैज वेरी स्ट्रॉन्ग सेंस ऑफ साइट हियरिंग स्मेल एंड टच ए टाइगर can see six times more than us at night isn't it amazing next hearing the sense of hearing of a tiger is so strong that it can make out the difference between rustling of leaves and sound made by an animal on grass moving on grass and it helps it to catch the prey and its ear can move in many direction to catch the sound from all the directions like dogs tigers also make out their area and in fact they make very large area by urinating and if another tiger comes in that area they at once know that another tiger has come and all the tigers of that area attack on the foreign or intruder tiger the whiskers the whiskers of tiger are very sensitive they can sense the vibration in the air it helps the tiger to catch its prey and see at night in dark but tigers are still in danger although it is one of the most alert animals it is in danger now how because of the poachers and hunters they kill the tigers for their skin and other body parts also many animals are killed like crocodiles snakes elephants rhinos musk deer for for their different body parts and it is very bad we must protect animals because they help in balancing the nature without animal we cannot survive because one there will be imbalance forest will disappear disappear and we will disappear to protect the tigers government of india 
made some tiger reserves. Almost 50 tiger reserves are there in India. Few of them are Jim Corbett National Park, that is in Uttarakhand, Bandipur National Park, it is in Karnataka, Simlipal, it is in Odisha, Palamu in Jharkhand, and Sundarban in West Bengal. Rest of you, you can see from the net or books. Now, what till now what we have learnt? Animals have amazing senses, they are called super senses, they have senses of smell, senses of sight, senses of hearing and senses of touch. With the help of senses of smell, they can recognize their group members, find the path, find the partner as the silk moth, make out their area as dogs and tigers do. We have also sense organs. We are also benefited from the or sense of smell. We identify the food. Something is burning. We can identify it. If there is leakage in gas, we find it with the help of sense of smell and whether food is spoiled or not, we find it. Now, sense of sight also helps animals. Position of eyes, eyes of birds help them to get wider range of view. And some animals sleep for more times and some animals sleep for less time. Nocturnal animals remain active at night and rest of the animals remain active at daytime. Size of the ear also matter. Big ears help to hear clear sound and snakes hear by the vibration in the ground. Also, we discussed about tiger. It has one of the most alert animals because of it has many amazing sense organs. And its sight is amazing, its smell is amazing, and it can hear very faint sound and make out the difference between rustling of leaves and sound of animal moving on grass. To protect tigers, government of India has made some tiger reserves and where tigers are protected. We also sensitize people to protect tiger and also all the animals because animals balance the nature and nature is God. Now we may conclude this topic with some animals have super senses for number one to make them efficient enough to live in their surrounding, for example, to get food, protection, working together, as you have seen in the case of ants, finding friends, as you have seen in the case of male insects, silkworm, marking areas, sending messages. Number two, to let them survive in the adverse situation, for example, in cold winter, the lizards go into cracks to survive them from the cold, severe cold. Third, senses of human beings also help them in many ways to live in their surroundings. As you have seen earlier, to find out the leakage in gas, cooking gas with the help of a smell to find out whether the food has got spoiled or not. It also makes them comfortable to live in their surroundings, as you have seen in the case of Susila. Okay, now it is activity time. You have to make paper dog. Okay, for this, you require a thick paper sheet, 
like this a pair of scissors pencil and a sketch pen now how we made this paper dog for this first you have to mark mark it number 1 2 3 Four, five, and six. You have to mark at six places. Then you make eyes first with pencil. Then you make eyes and mouth with sketch pen. And at top you make also. one mark now at the marks you have to cut like this cut half portion one 3 5 then second fourth and sixth position you don't cut it completely Com cut half then what you have to do you also cut here to make Years. Now, what you have to do now? You have to first hook the first position with the second position. Now do it. Hooked. Then third position with the fourth position. Hook it. Hooked. Next, fifth position with the sixth position. Now your half work is completed. Now you have to make legs. For that. you cut here this is four leg and for making hind leg you cut here you have to make ears then turn it also turn it now we have to make eyes and mouth with the help of sketch pen eyes then mouth now your paper dog is ready is it fun now activity time is over it is fun time that means play time now we have to find out how dogs mark their area as we have seen in chapter we select a dog suppose this the name of this dog is rocky okay there are some dogs they are in their area and you know how they mark their area they move in their area they urinate here and there and 
mark their area with their urine and put it. Now suppose this dog is moving in this area and it smells the urine. What will happen? Nothing because this dog is familiar with the smell of potty and urine of all the group members of that area. Therefore, it will move here comfortably. Now, suppose this Rocky, the, this is not the member of this group, sees a food. It comes here and think, what a good food. And as it enters here, it becomes a lot. How? Because first it will smell the urine. And by the smell of urine, it knows that, oh, it is dangerous area. That means I am going to enter in the area of other dogs. And then it will try to avoid that area. But if it dares to find the food and come inside, what will happen? All the dogs will start barking and they chase them, chase it away. And it will run away from their area and say, Jan Bachito Lakho Pai, Lord Ke Buddhu, Ghar Ko Ai. I hope you enjoyed it. Do it, practice it, and play it. Thank you.